Scholars, welcome back. If this is your first time here, I'm Bree, and welcome to Modern Living with Bree, where I share DIYs, decorating, and organization to keep my modern home comfortable and beautiful, while providing ideas and inspiration for your home. Coming up for today. Hello, Bree Stylers. How are you guys doing? I'm excited to bring to you guys this small haul. If you haven't been out there already, it is a great time to go check out some of your favorite stores for fall. They already have the fall items out there for at least for about a month. And they are on sale, guys. So if I was you guys, I'll go out and check it out. We have a small haul for the fall. As you can see, my walls are bare. I have emptied everything out of the room so I can begin decorating fall. So stay tuned for those um, videos. It's just going to be a series. It's called Fall Into Autumn Series. So I'm excited about that. I hope you guys stay tuned for that. We bring you some great things. So I have Amazon, Home Goods, and Hobby Lobby. So it's a small haul, guys, but I just wanted to share with you what's out there and on sale. If you're new to the channel, welcome. I'm Bree. Welcome to Modern Living with Bree. What I normally do on my on my hauls, I um, insert a picture either this side or this side <laughs> to um, share with you the item, the item description, the cost, and where you can find it. So all you have to do is put that information on your search and you will find these items. Um, if I don't have time to link these items in the description, you can use that information to find the items you need if you find something that you like. So we are going ahead and begin with the first item. This is all from Amazon, mostly from Amazon. Actually, I should have called it an Amazon fall <laughs> haul. So Amazon had these beautiful ornaments. They are flocked. And I have them in green. And they had several colors, as you guys can see in the um, description in the box up there. But I love these. They are the right size to add that nice green. They have them in different sizes too. So I'm thinking what I'm going to do is I'm going to go back and order the bigger size in this same color here. But these are so beautiful. And um, if you guys remember, last year I did a DIY in flocking some ornaments. So I think I will still continue to do that. But, um, you know, they can be pretty expensive buying all the materials. So uh, these were, as you can see, how much they are. And um, you get 15 of them, guys. 15. That's a lot for the price. And I think it was approximately $20 or around there or more but I love these these are so so pretty and I love the forest green almost like a not an olive green yeah I guess you say a forest green very very pretty love them I love them so that was on Amazon and then like I said they had it in many 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 colors so check that out so that's that, and let's see what else we have here. Ah, pumpkins. So that's next on the list here. These are a set of 12 pumpkins. These are black. They have them in several colors, guys. Beautiful pumpkins. I love these because they're velvet material that's laid over like of a foam, a foam full on form. And they are so, so pretty. I use these on my autumn tree. Oh yeah, I will be um, doing a video on my autumn tree coming up soon. So this is gorgeous. I have these in several colors on my autumn tree. And like I said, they come in various sizes. So we have, this is probably a medium. This is the large one. I love the stem. It looks so lifelike. And this is a small one. And this is the mini one. They have a little mini one. So they have four sizes. 
and you get since you get 12 of these I think you get three of each size so yeah I am whoop, come back here I am loving these and what I like them so much is that they're actual material laid over the form so that means that this will last a long time sometimes I like the flock um, I do but after so many uses they start to rub off so I love velvet that's what I really like and if I could find velvet instead of flock I would end up getting that first but beautiful beautiful pumpkins and as you can see there they come in several several colors all right so that's from Amazon Next, now I didn't put these pillows in the picture because I've already um, purchased these pillows before and I used them in my um, summer uh, decorate with me and I wanted to get some more because they were so pretty. These are the, uh, what do you call them, oblong pillows. The 20 by 12, I think it is, in blue clay, and this is in black. I have them, I'm going to show you the other colors I got in the 20 by 20, but this is gorgeous. I love them so much that I had to buy another set, guys. So, <laughs> and it's, it's two for a price, I think it may be less than $15, as you guys can see. Oh, wait, you can't see, but I think it's less than $15 for this. If I'm not mistaken. If not, it ain't no more. They less than 25 for two. <laughs> so, guys, in some of these, if you're new to the channel, some of these I would share a video that I probably um, have for them so you can get a closer look at how I style them. So, I haven't did it for all of them, um, but I did do it for some of the items. So, And I love getting pillow covers, guys, because you can change them up and fold them up when you're done with them. They are less room, they take up less room when you store it. I love pillow covers. I'd rather have those. And if you haven't seen my, seen my video um, that I share with you guys how I store my pillow, pillow covers, I will link that in the i card or in the description box. Now, here comes some more pillow covers. I have these in two different colors. Like I said, I love the boot clay, so I went and tried these out. Now, my colors for fall is black white kind of a camel color and maybe a tan color and i wanted to get some pillow covers in that color so we're going to go with the i think they call this toffee or coffee or something like that <laughs> and these are 20 by 20 guys love the color this is pretty this is a 20 by 20 the same material as before is by the same manufacturer. It's blue bouquet and um, love the material. Has the hidden zipper and yeah. So I have it in this color. That's this color right here. So it's so pretty. So this one and the black. See how pretty that goes together? That is really nice. I love how pretty that is. It goes together. We put the two pillows together. So that is so, so pretty. The camel, the black, and the coffee. I think that's what it says. So I think that is such a pretty, pretty, pretty colors together. All right, moving right along. Now I normally only do, on my hauls, I only do decor stuff but this time I would purchase a tote a bag tote bag and I always wanted one of these I say oh I'm sorry let me just get this out before I stop talking so you hear me I always wanted one of these and I've seen these Last year, one of my friends had this. I think hers was white and tan. No, not white and tan. Tan and black. Something like that. 
And I thought, oh, that is so pretty. I'm going to give me one of these. But I couldn't find it. And then I finally came across it. Amazon had it. <laughs> Look at this. Mark Jacobs, the, the tote bag by my, Mark Jacobs. Love it. I finally, finally got one. And I kept putting it back and kept putting it back and saying that I was going to get it. And, um... Yeah, I decided to go ahead and get it. So I finally got it. It was on sale. I think it was $176, but it went down to something like $130 or so. But I love this bag. This is the right size tote bag. You put your phone in, put your iPad in, put all your makeup or whatever, and your wallet, and, and you're good to go. But let me open it up my first time opening seeing it guys so it has all kind of paper in here it also has oh the Mark Jacobs license card inside here it has all kinds of room so as you can see the room in here it has a shoulder strap that you can do a crossbody and it has a zipper at the top and on the sides and the seams it has the the Marc Jacobs seam ribbon stripped down on the sides there that's sewn there and I thought that was a nice little accent it also has a um, ring here to put on, to uh, snap on your cross. It has a loop on the side here. Not quite sure what's that for, but I guess you can use it for whatever. It's um, very thick and stitched very nicely. But then, like I said, it's Mark Jason, Jacob. So it has a flat bottom. It doesn't have feet at the bottom, though. It's only thing. So I'm going to have to watch where I set it down at. It seems like it has something on it already. Let's see, can I get it? Casual, a very casual tote. And the back, it has the Marc Jacobs style and the identification tag right here on the back of the tote. Very, very nice. And this is a, a canvas bag with the white lettering. The tote bag with Marc Jacobs name down at the bottom. Very nice. I am loving this. Love the um, handles. Very strong. Very um, beautifully made. So, yeah. I finally got it. It took me forever. I was trying to see if they had... They don't have any pockets in here, guys. No zipper pockets or nothing like this. They came in different... This came in different sizes. This is the small. It has one... Two bigger than this, I believe. So they have one medium and one large. Maybe those come with a zipper pocket and things like that in it. So since this did not come with any kind of pockets or anything like that, what I did is I purchased an organizer. This came from Amazon. This organizer has two pieces. And basically, you place this inside your, your tote bag and it has pockets on the side, on each side. And you take this and it has um, the Velcro on each side. And you snap it on the side like this. And it gives you a middle compartment it divides the organizer it also has oh it don't have i thought it had pockets on the outside but it doesn't so you have a zipper pocket now for inside and then you have two pockets on each side inside the um the side of the organizer and they had these in different sizes specifically to fit the Marc Jacobs tote bag. So we're going to see if this is going to fit. So let's 
So they said specifically to fit this. So we're going to see. Put this inside here. Yep. It fits perfectly. Look at that. Ah, love it. Love it, love it. Yep, it fits perfectly, guys. Look at that. Matter of fact, it really forms the um, tote bag. So it gives it a nice shape. So I might as well just keep it inside here when I store it. Oh, I'm loving this. This is so nice. So, um, I did film a close-up, guys, so you can get a good look of how it looks and everything. Beautiful bag. I'm quite satisfied. remember I said I was collecting marble and I am still collecting it and I came across this beautiful candle set radical or they give you a certificate of authenticity so that's something <laughs> and I really 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 love these they come in black I don't know how they have this. Okay. They have them individually packed in here and taped together. All right. Kind of strange. But anyway, we'll run with it. So, these are a set of three. Ooh, these are so heavy very nice quality of okay and it comes in a small medium and large okay so let's look at the small one first Oh, this is gorgeous. Look at that. Beautiful. Oh, man, this is gorgeous. It almost looks like a Calcutta marble. The only thing is that it's polished. I am not a fan of polished marble. I like it um, matte looking, so it looks natural to me. But I'll take it. I, I, I will take it because it's still pretty. Um, but I prefer a matte sheen on it if, if they're going to put a sheen on it. Or just natural. Look at that. That's, that's the medium. Gorgeous. This is really, really heavy. And basically these are for tea lights. So you put your tea lights inside. I'm look, trying to look for a nice stand. If I, if I can find an acrylic stand for each of these or an iron uh, metal stand or maybe even a marble stand. Okay, so on the bottom they have a flat surface and that is not polished. See, I wish they had left it like this on the bottom of it. It's not, it's no sheen at all. But like I said, I'll take it. It's no sheen. Yes, yeah, it's, it's a little sheen inside. But yeah, this is the largest. If you drop this, you're going to hurt something. Something. <laughs> because this is really, really, really heavy. <laughs> but it's a good quality marble. And you can see how much it costs there for the set. They have them in different colors. I think it was white. And another one was kind of a tan color. So, I think these are going to look so so nice and on the um, entry table 
or a side table. That's why I said it would look really nice if you had a stand of some sort, like a marble um, platter or something like that to stand them on on a side table. These will be really, really, really gorgeous. So that's these. Very pretty. Loving it, loving it. And now there is one more item that I have from Amazon that is marble that I'm very excited about. So, and as big as this is, it's not as heavy as those marble candle tea light holders. But this, when it came in, I was like, what is this? Because I had to sign for it. Um, the UPS, not UPS, FedEx person came in and it was all wrapped up and taped up and everything. And I'm like, what is that? I thought it came from overseas and it probably could have. But um, I've been wanting one of these bows. I've been seeing these bows on several. I can't think of her name. I see it in my head. She is a creator, beautiful home, beautiful stylist. She's more on the glam side a little bit. What is her name? But she had these bows. And these bows come in two different colors. They come in the tan color and they come in this bone or off-white color. So I'm taking all the stuffing out. Oh my goodness. It is heavy. Now this is a 10 inch guys. Now as you can see on the description below that these came in various sizes. I mean many, many, many sizes. They also comes in a set of three. But you can um, purchase them individually. Some sizes you can purchase it individually. Now this is a 10 inch. Look how pretty this is. Isn't that gorgeous? Beautiful. And yes, it's expensive. Not very expensive. But for a 10 inch bowl, it's, but it's marble. It's solid marble. Gorgeous. All one piece. There is no partials glued together. One piece of marble. So I guess you purchase, get what you purchase. And can you imagine they had this in 12 inch, a 15 inch, and an 18 inch. And I looked at that, I looked at the 18 inch and I was imagining how I could put that on my coffee table, on my entry table, and just that it would be beautiful. But they wanted it was $404 and the 12 inch, I think it was 200 and something. I would swing the 15 inch. I would swing that because that's pretty big too. And to have three of these together as a set, oh, that would be gorgeous. So I thought I'd start with a 10 inch just to give me a good uh, measure of um, size when I get ready to style something with it. Then I would get a um, eight inch below that and then the 15 inch or um, 12 inch to make it a three piece set. But you see how gorgeous this is. It's beautiful, just gorgeous. And you know, they do have them um, cheaper on Amazon. I get thinking you can get it something like $29, maybe $49. I'm not sure where they made up, maybe some sort of porcelain or something like that. You can get it cheaper. You don't have to get marble. Just gorgeous. So that's it for Amazon. So I am going to actually, I'm just going to go ahead and go all through because I only got two things left. Ooh. Okay. Huh. Only have two things left. I'll just clean up once I'm done. Okay, so the next thing is from Home Goods. And of course, you know, you can't go online and, and, and get things from Home Goods because it's like they have more than one. 
but it, I never could find it. <laughs> so I just took a picture of it and, and you can see it. But this was $14.99. Isn't this gorgeous? It's a container. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful with the uh, gold top here. Let me take off this. Um, here before I drop it. All right, and I see this piece here. I'm trying to keep from getting too many small pieces unless it's marble. <laughs> but um, I'm like, go big, go home kind of thing now. <laughs> but here is the top. Man, it's this what it looks in inside. It's hollow inside. Beautiful, beautifully made. I'm trying to see. Does it say who it's by? It's by Acropos. It looks like a Greek name. Storage box ceramic. It's size, as you can see up there, 15.2 by 15.2 by 17.8 SS centimeters, which is 6 by 6 by 7 inches. And it's a Acropos home collection. This is the inside of the container. I love the ridges on the outside. I think that's a thing that's going on. I, I'm, I'm very attracted to these days are the ridges. Don't know why, but you know how you get into those moves, the things that you used to like, like silver. I used to love silver, but I'm out of that phase. I, it'll probably come back. And now I'm into these ridges now and these big, huge decor. Now I'm into marble. So, yeah. So the next thing for fall. So we had black pumpkins for fall, y'all. So now we over here for more pumpkins. Now, most of you know, I don't decorate with a lot of pumpkins. Not really. No. But when I see velvet pumpkins, it kind of draws me. I just love the look of it. It's very luxurious looking. I'm not into the the regular like plastic pumpkins or I would do wood pumpkins for the outside of the house like on the porch but that's about it but velvet pumpkins I will do and um, it will only go on something that's like a floor arrangement or by um, auto tree so as you can see, I have a video here with these are decorated on my autumn tree. These from Hobby Lobby, they were $6.99. I bought about 10 of these. These are gorgeous. And as you can see on my autumn tree, how I style them. But look how long the stem is. I don't know if you can see that here. Very, very long. Must be about 17 inches. No, then more than that. It's got to be at least 20 something inches tall on here. But I love that they have the vines that's coming out of it. So you can really accentuate your look with these vines that sticks out. And it looks gorgeous on a tree or a floor arrangement. Have a few of these inside your vase with your fall um, florals for your uh, floor arranger for fall, but yes, beautifully done. Um, I purchased the black balls from them that I also used in my floor arrangement, and I, not floor arrangement, in my um, autumn tree, and I also used those black uh, pumpkins in my autumn tree that I had purchased for them, but the black balls I purchased from them last year, I believe it was, that I used for Christmas, and um, who I seen these, Oh, I know who I seen this from. From my girl. You know, every time she does a haul, if it be between Wani from Wani's house, if you guys don't know who I'm talking about, um, she has a nice channel. Check her out. Or the glamorous Penny Pincher. She went out the Hobby Lobby on a haul and um, <laughs> picked these up. And I'm like, I want those. And I went. We have a Hobby Lobby, but it's about an hour and a half from here that you have to get to. And I didn't feel like doing that. 
And I know how um, these are, they sell out very quickly. Matter of fact, I don't think they have any more of the bone ones anymore. Um, as you can see, they have the turquoise, they have the orange ones, they have the burgundy ones, and they had the green ones. The green ones are gorgeous. And they had these here. And I think they sold out of this because I don't think I've seen it online anymore. They might have them in the stores. So if you guys have a Hobby Lobby by you, you better get out there and get these because they sell out very quickly. Um, last year, they didn't have them. They sold out very quickly. Um, yeah, but these are gorgeous. They're velvet. There's about one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten pumpkins on each stem. I love that they are, the stem is a very dark, dark, I don't know if it's dark, dark brown or is it black. Love, love, love the color of this. This is a, like a bone color, maybe an off-white. These are so pretty, guys. So like I said, if you're going out there to get some decor for fall this year, you better get out there quickly because they're on sale. And those are already sold out. So especially if you have a Hobby Lobby, uh, go and check them out. So that is it, guys. Like I said, a small haul. I didn't get more than probably about eight or nine items. But yeah, just to give you an idea what's out there for this fall. And I hope you enjoyed it. And if you see anything you like, like I said, you can use the description and put them in the um, search bar on your computer and get those from each store. Or I may go ahead and put the links in the description box so you can get uh, that way. So thank you so, so, so much, guys, for joining me. If you're new to the channel, hey, you're a returning subscriber. Mm -hmm. Love, 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 love you so much for being a subscriber to my channel. Thank you again for joining me for another video, and I will see you guys on the next one. You made it to the end of the video, so you must like what you see. Why don't you go ahead and subscribe to the channel? It doesn't cost a thing, and I love to have you part of the Bree Style family. Also, click the notification bell twice so you'll be notified when I upload. I see you on the next one. Smooches!